All right, Ready? rolling. Take one. And playback. We're working on the video for our new single, Soul on Fire. It's our second single off our new record, Lighting Up the Sky. I'm gonna be directing this video, actually. Worked with these guys here at Studio Lab to create a really cool script. The band is just gonna be the band doing their thing and creating as much energy on stage as possible. Sarah is gonna be playing the part of desire and temptation, so she's gonna be more of an entity than anything else that we don't see. We don't hear, but we just kind of feel her presence. Just ready to get the stay going, create some magic, make a big rock video. It was challenging at first to kind of figure out how we could literally incorporate fire into a song called Soul on Fire without it being cheesy. So I, I really think that like taking this approach to just allowing the band to do what the band does and interacting with some entity that's around us is um, a, a very unique and cool way to be able to pull off the concept of this song. We have our dear friend Sarah Maylett here who is going to be our star model and play the part of Desire. She's going to be more of an entity than anything else. We're uh, looking forward to getting her up on the screen and seeing what kind of magic we can create. What we're up to? Yeah. Here's what we're up to. She's <laughs> making a little Godsmack music video. I think, you know what we need? Now that I'm seeing you doing this, it'll help me get some ideas too. Can we just have you maybe walk here, the angle of the body's better. It's just important, these establishing shots, that we get them right to set the tone. That's fucking hot. Yes. When we wanted her to be a little bit more elegant and in control and confident and flowy, I was really thinking about people like Stevie Nicks and her outfits and that kind of stuff, how she had that really witchy vibe, but it was like very flowy, sheer mesh outfits and stuff like that. Yeah, that's good. You can be smiling, you can wink, you can blow a kiss. I don't care what you do. We'll find a moment, you know, be a little bit more playful in the face. Awesome job, Sarah. The face is killer on that one. So we're going on to the second look which will be a little bit more playful and fun. So she's going to reach now and break the plane from video to reality by passing through the video screen and sending her arm out to be able to touch one of the members. She will then get zapped by the power of the amp, getting her really pissed off to turn into the black outfit. At that point, just make a move and pass through the video wall onto the stage with the band and then try to dominate us, which isn't gonna happen. Action, three, two, one. Set my soul on fire. Reach for the camera. Snap back, cut. Thank you guys, we appreciate it. We'll see you next Tuesday. Oh wow, <laughs> see you next Tuesday, literally. <laughs> Seeing everyone next Tuesday. Um. Which is when the band comes in to rock. So here we are, back at uh, Events United Studio Lab. Day number two, band performance day. Look how badass this girl is. Makes Pam Anderson look like nothing. It's a great song too. I think it's gonna do well uh, at radio. Yeah, it's a little bit different sound for us too. Yeah. It has like a, a punk edge. Exciting, yeah. high energy, yeah. rock. Great guitar solo. <laughs> it is Where's the fucking yeah, you learning the song? <laughs> Last chord. Just take a second to get back into it. I get it though. 
Oh, it's good getting back together. We haven't seen each other since the tour. The band's gonna escalate into some pyro scenes. We're gonna morph her out of the video screen and she's gonna be able to be that entity that kind of walks around us. She's in our space now and she knows she can get to us and she can touch us. As the song progresses into the last chorus and everything's heating up on the stage, the fire gets bigger and bigger, the energy of the music pushes her back towards the video screen and traps her back in video world. Now has transformed into a really devilish, kind of angry, fiery woman. This is the only way I can describe the emotion is from the time, you know, you come in and you just look around real quick. It's got to be a meltdown from that point. I'm like, fuck, you have to be fucking pissed. Just let it rip, Sarah. I know that you've been mad at least once in your life. And let's do playback. Okay, stay up on her high. Start to go back, screaming. Arch your back, back, back. Awesome, cut. That's a wrap. Is there some good, good moments with you in that? You actually look a little bit like Pam Anderson in that shot at times. I don't know if he plans these things like a sitting and plotting or something, or if they just come to him from the universe. I think it's the latter, where he's just like, you know what, guys? You know? And then it's on. Or he could sit there and be a mad scientist plotting that shit, you know? This is more important. Yeah. Um, even if you went a little more this way and, and tightened your, and tighten this side up, that's even cool right there. So we're setting up this really cool shot that I'm excited about. It's going to have her actually buried in a pile of black ash and sand and soot folded over into like this almost a yoga position. And then we're just going to have her rise from the ashes, so. This is going to be a really cool shot, I think. Make sure you keep your head down to that like another we talked about and just freeze there. How's that? This is going to roll good. Are you guys ready? So should we call two action shots here? Yeah. Maybe get camera I mean, in motion and then have a rise? Yep. Okay, get set. Camera action. Go, go camera. Sarah action. Good. Let's cut. And that's a wrap on Sarah! Sarah is done. That's a wrap for the mighty Sarah. She fucking killed it, by the way. Peace.